Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Sunday Morning Simulcast with Rom Wills. Let go of negative emotions. Y'all gotta let those things go. I mean, and I'm gonna tell you what. No matter what we have going on outside for us, like we could, we could be like a person that other people consider physically attractive, you know. If you're a man, a handsome face, a woman, a beautiful face, you can have that killer body, man or woman. Shoot, you could be a stylish dresser. You can be educated. You could be making six figures. You can have a lot of stuff. But one thing that will mess you up is negative emotions. And that's if you have everything going on for you on the outside. A lot of people ain't where they want to be in life. A lot of people, they're not in good relationships or, you know, they're not making the money they want. They're just not enjoying things. But the key to dealing with that is not just simply, you know, change, putting on some clothes or changing your body or, you know, even getting another job. Because as long and you can do all that stuff, but as long as those negative emotions come uh, there, it'll uh, mess you up. And in really the normal case is it'll keep you from getting what you want because you got that negative emotion and then you trying to elevate yourself. It ain't going to happen in most cases. In most cases, sometimes you can get lucky, you get someplace, but it catches up to you at some point. It's always a problem because understand something, understand something. People got to realize the universe is mental. I don't care. I don't care what a person look like, what they got in their bank account. Everything starts in their mind. Everything, everything you do, all, you know, and your mind, your thoughts are affected by your emotions. Because your emotions can give you a negative outlook on life. It can give you especially a negative outlook on yourself. Like what if you feel in that, you know, that emotions that lead you to be depressed, you know, in depression, shoot. That'll stop you. That'll stop you from going anyplace. Or your emotions lead you to having anxiety. You know, you'll be worried about everything you could do, you know, or it can make you sad most of the time or manic or, you know, there's so many things that your emotions, if they are negative in any way, can hurt you. Shoot, it can even like reduce your IQ. That's how that's how deep it is. You know what? You got to let them go. That's the key to everything, right? That's, that's, that's the key. That's the key to changing your life. You got to change how you think. You got to deal with those emotions because they affect how you think. And you, the negative emotions is, is tough. Now, it's, it's not always easy because those negative emotions could, in many cases, stem from a traumatic event in your life, even going back to childhood. Though This is what I suggest. First... Just admit to yourself, look yourself in the mirror and say, okay, there's a problem. That's the first and foremost. Admit that these emotions are causing a problem. That's the thing. You got to be introspective right there, right? So you got to say, look, you know what? This is causing me a problem. Okay, that's the first thing. The second thing, get help. Get help. Don't be afraid to get a therapist, a spiritual leader, an elder, a best friend you can tell stuff to. Talks to somebody dependent. And then if it's like, you know, if it's a, it, especially, especially if it uh, stems from a negative event in childhood, don't be afraid to talk to a therapist. I'm serious. I'm serious. You Whatever help you got to get, you know, therapist, spiritual leader, you know, whoever, whoever you got to go to. If you're strong enough, hey, maybe you can just sit there and just face it yourself. Hey, if you can do that, that's great. Whatever you need to do to deal with that emotion. And then it's important to deal with it in the moment. You know, deal with it in the moment and be realistic about it. And when I say in the moment, don't think, oh, okay, I'll deal with it then or it'll be better in this amount of time. You really don't know because you don't know how deep it is. That's one of those things you got to take care of every day. You got to face it every day. You know, so you get help. Another thing you could do every time you have that negative emotion, think of something positive. I'm going to tell you something I do because everybody gets negative emotions at some point. It's just a question of how much it impacts them. Do they keep it, get it for a second 
a minute, a day, a week, a month, a year. Some people have been in some negative emotions for years. But everybody will get it every now and then. I will get a negative emotion every now and then. I ain't going to, look, I'm just going to be real with you. I don't mind saying that. I ain't like just happy rhyme all the time because that's just life. Stuff going to happen. You're going to have a reaction. But one thing I do every single time, every single time I get a negative emotion, I don't dwell on it. I was like, oh, wait a minute, I'm feeling all bad. Okay, I started looking for something positive to think about. <laughs> I, I replaced that with a positive emotion. I find something, right? Or just be calm there or face it or, you know, look at the issue on why I even had that emotion. Because sometimes I get a negative emotion, negative thought. I say, look, why am I thinking like that? Or why am I feeling that way? You know? And what is it in me that responded to it that way? Now, that's me, though. And like I said, my stuff will come and go. And, you know, a lot of people say, you know, Rom, you're always calm and everything. Hey, well, you know, I am had to work at it. I'm human. Shoot, I can I can get a temper like anybody else, all of that. And that's negative, too, if, if I'm walking around in some anger. But then I'd say, all right, hold up. I'm feeling this way. Let me stop. Let me breathe. Let me be calm. And then on a situation, depending on it, I might talk with somebody. Now, personally, I haven't had to go to therapy because I've got some really good people sometimes and to talk to. And sometimes, baby, just talk something out. Heck, if you got to get in front of the mirror and talk it out, whatever, talk it out. Just get it out. Let it go because negative emotions can affect everything. Like I have a really good friend that's losing some weight now. And, you know, and I said, I actually said to her, I said, oh, oh wow, you dealt with some stuff, didn't you? She was like, yeah. She was like, yeah, I dealt with some stuff. Man, I could see I could see the results of it. Because, uh, you know, you keep some um, negative emotion, it could affect you physically. It can actually make you sick, too. That's, that's how deep it is. That's how deep some emotions are. A lot of people's uh, sicknesses actually come from emotion. And every single thing, of course. Of course. But a lot of times people can feel better just by dealing with the emotions behind it. That's why, like, sometimes placebos, placebo medicines work with people and work for people because they just thinking differently. In fact, like, there's been, um, I've seen some studies, like, if they show somebody, like, in the hospital or something, and, you know, they're feeling all bad, but they get somebody to come in and their relatives and they're laughing and everything, they just feel better because their emotions would change. That's how powerful it is. Now, like I said, you ain't going to look, you ain't going to go through life emotionless. Let's let's get that clear. Something's going to happen. But you have to deal with it. You have to deal with it as best as possible. You know, like I said, you do have situations where, um, you know, you're going to get something. Something happened. You know, somebody cut you off in traffic. You might feel that anger or something or, you know. Your, your sports, your favorite sports team might lose, you know, when they were playing. And you might be like, oh, man, dang, my team lost. I don't know, you know, getting on your nerves and everything, right? So you just like, wow, okay. But then you got to just calm down, get through it. And then, like I said, look, I'm going to reiterate. I'm gonna, and this is very important, very important. If it's some deep stuff, something that goes back to childhood, something that you live with, with in life, talk to a med- mental health professional. Very, I'm serious. Because a lot of people's problems out here, it's, it's a serious mental health thing. And, um, you know, I need to do maybe not um, a Sunday morning uh, podcast talking about that, but just a major, major video and have some guests on there to talk about it with. That's how deep it is. But whatever the case, whatever, however you want to do it, however you want to approach it, your bottom line is you have to let go of negative emotions. Very key. So uh, meditate on my message and have a great Sunday morning. Peace and blessings.